We're going to interrupt that story to take you live now to Melbourne, where the Prime Minister, Tony Abbott, is speaking at the official opening of the Serena Russo Job Access Ringwood office. Let's take a listen. Can place people into work. I, I don't imagine any of you realised that Serena's job placement services extended to placing someone in the Prime Ministership, but apparently they do. <laughs> apparently they do. Uh, Fifteen years ago the process began and it uh, came to fruition uh, on, in September of 2013. Uh, look, it is good to be here. Very, very good to be here. It's good to see such enthusiastic people. It's good to be with Michael Suker, the local member. It's good to be with the Mayor and members of Council. It's great to be here with uh, my friend and colleague Erica Betts, the Leader of the Government in the Senate, it's good to be here with the future Prime Minister of Israel. I didn't realise I was in such company. Um, great to be here with the, uh, the finest member the Australian Parliament has not yet had, Dean Michael Kroger, uh, our President here in Victoria. But look, it is, it is, uh, it is uh, above all else, Serena, good to be here with you because you are a force of nature and um, I was browsing through uh, some of the uh, lessons for life which you gave us uh, in your book. First, accept responsibility for your life. Uh, second, never stop learning. Fourth, never give up. Uh, fifth, believe in yourself. I mean, these are all marvellous lessons and I guess uh, they're common sense lessons and yet so many people forget them. So many people program themselves to fail and what you're doing here is reprogramming people to succeed. That's what you're doing here. Uh, Michael, you were good enough to share with us your early work experience. Uh, um, I suppose I should follow suit. Uh, my first job was as a labourer in an enamel factory. Uh, I think it was one of Dad's rotary connections that got me that job. My second job uh, was uh, as a barman in the Illinois Hotel in Five Dock. It's still there on Parramatta Road, corner of Parramatta Road and the Great Northern Road if you want to drive uh, past it. Uh, I think it was uh, uh, the father of a school friend who got me that job. But not all of us have those connections and it's the job of Serena Russo uh, Job Access to provide us with the connections and the skills that we need in order to get work when we don't currently have them. So it really is absolutely vital work uh, that you and your team are doing, Serena. Uh, yes, uh, we need people who have a have-a-go mindset. That's what you're creating every day, people with a have-a-go mindset. Uh, this government, in everything it does, is trying to encourage people to have a go. Um, I say every day, uh, what we're on about is very simple, jobs, growth, community safety, jobs, growth, community safety. And there are lots of things that we do uh, to uh, create jobs and growth. Uh, cutting taxes, very, very important. Uh, cutting regulation, very important. We need to liberate uh, the small businesses in particular of our country uh, to get on and do better what only they can do best and that is to create jobs. Building infrastructure, absolutely critical and it is so disappointing that having cancelled the East-West Link, um, the Victorian Government has not yet come up with an alternative but we are constantly working with the Victorian Government uh, to find job creating infrastructure projects uh, here in Victoria. And we look forward uh, to the uh, West-East Link uh, which uh, the Victorian Government seems to be inching its way uh, towards. Um, we've had 335,000 jobs uh, created in our economy since September 2013. Um, here in this area, uh, unemployment has gone down from 6.6% to 5.8%. The participation rate has gone up from 60% to 66% in the last 12 months. These are dramatic improvements and Serena, you and your team are at the heart of this. Um, if you're serious about jobs, if you're serious about growth, you've got to be in favour of the free trade agreement or the export agreement with China. This government uh, emphatically is. Uh, you've got to be in favour of new developments like the Carmichael mine in Queensland uh, and you've got to be deeply sceptical about people who want to close down an industry 
which is one of Australia's greatest exports, the coal industry. You've got to be in favour of clean unionism because clean unions and uh, honest workplaces are what we need if we are to create good jobs for the future. Uh, and you've got to be supportive of the job active system. The new job active system is focused on working with employers. Uh, we reward job active providers not for processing the unemployed and not for training the unemployed but for actually turning the unemployed into the employed, placing people in work and keeping them there. Uh, there are 66 job active providers right around the country, 1,700 sites. Serena, as you say, you're the biggest private sector member of the job active system. Uh, you've got uh, close to 10 per cent of the job active market, uh, 100 sites or thereabouts around our country. You're also a very significant member of the new apprentice support network. Uh, uh, there are 11 providers, uh, 400 sites around the country because this is a government which is serious about working with people who want to have a go. You used a marvellous phrase, Serena, uh, just a moment ago in your speech, uh, finding the diamond in people. Everyone can be good at something. Uh, it's just a question of finding what it is. I could have been a employment minister all my life. But you saw, Serena, all those years ago, <laughs> that I had the potential <laughs> to be greater. And thank you for discerning that in me when very few others did, I have to say. <laughs> anyway, it's uh, terrific to be here, and it's uh, very good to be associated with this splendid occasion. And I'm very happy to be involved in the launch of uh, the new Job Active uh, and the launch of uh, or the relaunch of Serena Russo. Thank you.